Let's talk about Bronfenbrenner. Yuri Bronfenbrenner was a Russian-American psychologist who is responsible for developing the ecological systems theory. This theory examines the impact of children's social environments on how they are developing. He compared his theory to nesting dolls and that one will fit inside the other and comprises of five ecological systems that can impact our learning and development. First, you'll see that the child is at the center of everything. And then the first level is called the microsystem. This is the immediate environment surrounding the child and involves all of the people, places, and things that most directly influence the child. Some examples of this could include the child's family, their home, their teachers, and school. The next level is the mesosystem or the connections. The mesosystem refers to the relationships between all of the microsystems and how much influence they have over one another. For example, if mom and dad are divorced but still have a positive parenting relationship where they work together to meet their child's needs, the child will feel the positive impacts from that. Other relationships might include how close the family is with their child's teacher, the reinforcement of certain values within the household, or the types of friendships the child has. The third level is the exosystem. This refers to situations not directly involving the child, but where the child is still impacted. The example we use with the parents being divorced is a good example. While we discussed in the mesosystem that the parents have a good working relationship together to meet their child's needs and the child feels the positive impacts from that, the exosystem would involve the divorce itself. And even though mom and dad did divorce, those reasons did not involve the child. Another cut and dry example of the exosystem is if a parent lost a job. The exosystem would be that the parent is now unemployed, while the mesosystem effect would be that the parent now has extra time to spend with their child, or it could be that the, there is a lot more stress being put on the family due to the lack of income. Level four is the macrosystem, or the social and cultural context within a system and or the community itself. A good example for this is the holidays. Think about what your family celebrates. It's probably different from your other classmates because of the social and cultural context in which you were raised or have come to believe in. Going one step further, we could even say that Waco is a very different community to be raised in compared to Dallas or Austin. This has to do with the amount and different types of influences happening at this level. Finally, the chronosystem is how time can affect any of the levels and on any scale. Technology is a great example. Think about the technology you had growing up and think about what is available to us now. Even in the short term, technology has greatly impacted how we connect with each other and the access that we have to different information. Overall, Bronfenbrenner theorized that there are many different contexts and types of relationships occurring that impact how we learn and develop.